welcome to Sprouting 101 with Living Health Farms. Today we're going to go over the do's and don'ts and basic steps of sprouting. So here we have our general sprout kits. You may choose to purchase a stand or use a general bowl at home, but we do have the full sprouting kits available at Living Health Farms. Step one, let's measure some sprouts. Right now I'm just gonna measure out a tablespoon of seeds, which is about half the packet. Best to do this over something, just in case your hands are a little bit shaky. And then we're just gonna pour them in the jar. So once we have our seeds in our container, we are going to want to soak them. Some water here. I'm gonna do that. Leave them just like that. Just get a bowl. Pour it in there. Give it a little shake. We're gonna rinse them again, just because we really want that water to be pretty clear. Swivel, and then dump again. And shake it up, shake it up. So now we have our freshly rinsed seeds and we are going to make sure that we put them upside down so that we can make sure to get that last little water out. Now, we have provided a stand for purchase that works really, really well. Just pop it down like that and it drains through the holes in the center. So once we've rinsed and put our sprouts on the stand, we wanna make sure to place them in a place with non-direct sunlight and a well-ventilated room. So every day we wanna come back and make sure to give our sprouts a good shaking and very good rinse. Fill it all the way up, make sure to cover all of your sprouts. Now these sprouts have been going for a few days now, so they have their tails. Make sure to give it a good swig and pour. Remember to also shake when pouring, that helps to get oh, extra moisture out. And then we just place it back on our stand to get the rest of that drainage out. You'll start to get various different rates of ones that are fully green and ones that are still kind of yellow. So you wanna make sure to wait until all of them look like that. Once all of your sprouts have started to green, you're gonna to wanna to take them out, give them a good rinse, put them in a container, and put them in the refrigerator to enjoy later.